bullshitting with the boys. And I don't know if I can say that. You might want to cut that out. BSing with the boys. And uh, just trying to figure out the bike. We had a really good solid day of practicing and making a lot of good headway with the bike. And um, I think tomorrow is another day. I think we're good to go. Leave it on a good note on the day. Brah. <laughs> Vegas and day one we got our practice out of the way we had two practice sessions for each class uh, a lot of us are riding 10 inch and 12 inch so we've got about three or four rides on the track today the track is absolutely awesome it's new dirt it's really soft really tacky and you know lots of fun out there first session went out just got to know the track a little bit took it a bit easy and then the second session went out and did all the jumps and the triples and the rhythm sections and felt real cool and Man, I can't explain how cool it is to have Blows and McNeil and those pro guys riding with us on our team. You know, Blows is so fast. He just looks awesome on the track. And McNeil's obviously a pro rider and got a lot of a really good following. So it's great to have him here too. And be sharing this with Bender as well. Come up, another guy who's come over from Tasmania to ride with us. So it's been great fun. And another person who's riding on our team is Chris Dennison, who's the editor of Dirt Rider. So it's been great to have him on the team. You'll see a bit more footage from him over the next few days and we've been doing some photo shoots and some cool stuff. So it's been an awesome weekend. The, the mechanics have just been working their butts off. Just we're fine tuning, playing with gearing, lots of crazy stuff. So, you know, you know your factory when Blows said to the guys that he wanted a different pipe, they made him a pipe right here. So that is really cool. You know, you got a factory race truck when you can just bang a pipe together in 15 minutes. I'm riding 10 inch class and 12 inch class, so I have to do a wheel change. And Gaz Wellman is my wheeler, and we changed the wheels over in three and a half minutes, so that was pretty cool. And you know, something that you guys might want to do back home is have a spare set of wheels so you can have, basically, it feels like two different bikes. And all, all good fun, lots of photos coming your way. We're all knackered after a massive day, but we're loving it. So thanks, heaps. Make sure you check out the live video, the streaming video that you can check out. and. Keep up to date what we're doing and hopefully tomorrow's the big day. We don't ride till about 3 o'clock tomorrow. Got to get in the top five in our heat to get through to the main. And then got to be top Australian to get through to the world final. So, you know, big day tomorrow. I can't wait and looking forward to it. Thanks again and rah!
so uh, you're on motorbikes? <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> Oh yeah, what do you do? What do you got? Ah, oh, I got a Z50. You should see the thing at power band. Mate, that thing has got gnarly power band. I was racing Gav down at the pit the other day, hooning around there. Oh my God, thing hit power band and just looped out on me. Good story. Telling the boys about that one.